Good morning. Really fast video today, you guys. I'm still in my kind of uh, transient space here. I'm packing, organizing, but I saw this this morning on Prose, and I had to come on here for a couple of reasons and just introduce this writer and put the link to this challenge up. And uh, this is the monastic plain song of magpies. Now, use the title of this challenge as a prompt and include the five words somewhere in your piece of prose or poetry. No word limit, be as literal or as figurative as you like, and see what flight of fancy these magpies take upon you. Okay. What a great challenge. And so this brought me into who is this Marky Sparky guy? So I, I went into this profile, and what caught my eye this morning was the title of this post. Now, as a, a huge Bowie fan, this caught my eye right away. This is uh, one of my um, one of my favorite uh, eras of David Bowie. Um, just the um, the album is "Oh You Pretty Things," and this song is um, "Homo Superior" is a is a great. The lyrics are just they're impeccable, and um, anyone who knows me knows that I like what I always call smart music, right? And Bowie is smart music, and so musically and lyrically just one of our geniuses you know I, I always call him like the david lynch of songwriters but okay um i don't a huge fan of songwriting you know how you can like bridge like one word to make something happen in a song that wouldn't happen without that one second of extension it's just it's so cool to me anyway um this is such a great piece of writing and i'm going to link this challenge i'm going to link this post and i'm going to link this profile into the description i read this this morning with my coffee and i'll tell you it was the i felt like i was um like all good writing on this app does to me i was just transcended i was gone i was in all these rooms with this character and it was such a, such a cool view, POV in the story. And I can go on and on about the lines here and the structure and how, how much I liked this, especially toward the end with his father and the Bible and death meeting him ever so gracefully. But at the same time, there was, that, there was an impishness to his father as he was hitting that threshold. But also, it was just the entire psychology of this this character and this piece, and I have to say it's done really well. So thank you. As my mind wakes up and I'm learning to speak and pronounce this morning um, and read like I do every morning as my coffee hits my blood and begins coursing, um, I took this in and I was really, I was really happy with this writer and this post. So I want to share it. And that's going to wrap up this video. Thank you for being here, and uh, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Take good care. Unlock the potential of your writing with Prose Gold. Monetize your work and gain exposure to top agents and publishers. Join now and start sharing your stories with the world. Sign up for Prose Gold today. Theprose.com.